Kristen, wilt thou have this man be thy husband? I will. Wilt thou, Jefferson, have this woman to be thy wedded wife? Wilt thou provide her with credit cards and a four-bedroom, two-and-one-half bath home? Wilt thou listen patiently to long stories about kids' colds, kitchen towel, clothes, shoes, make a pair of sore feet, and decorate her chick for covers? I will. I pronounce that Kristen and Jefferson are husband and wife. In every married life, there are certain key phrases that ignite the imagination. What's for dinner tonight, sweetheart? You don't like fish? I love fish. It's just a little overwhelming to have a uh, grouper. Here. It's grouper. What are you going to do with your life? The question is, what can I do? You have a BA in advanced languages. What was your minor? Elizabethan poetry. Let's not fight. You're not sleeping in this bed. Oh, really? Anywhere but in this room or in this bed. So what do you want me to do, huh? Tell me, tell me, tell me. My parents are coming over this evening. This is good, Jake. You're quite a barbecue chef. What is this? What is this dirt on here? If I tell you something, will you promise not to get mad? Okay, I promise I won't get mad. I stopped taking the pill. Bacon, Elizabeth, in a new film by John Hughes. It's been 48 hours since our last coalition. My temperature's optimum. I'm ovulating. I have the pillow set up in the position. You can watch TV if you get bored. Here's to successful fertilization. She's having a baby. She's having a baby.